My name is Zama Katamzi Joseph. Um, I work for the South African National Space Agency as a research scientist. Um, my research includes um, looking at gravity waves in the ionosphere. I'm trying to understand what triggers them and how they behave in the ionosphere. Um, I also, um, and um, how the thermospheric winds play in, uh, a role in their behavior. So my stepdad is like a science fanatic. Um, he did science at school and um, so we'll always get this um, science fiction movies at home and stuff. What inspired me to work in this field is actually watching a movie, um, Armageddon. So when I watched this movie, I was so um, filled with wonder in, into what is astronomy and like how do people actually study things beyond um, in the sky and beyond what we know and what we're exposed to. And so when I, I decided that's what I wanted to do, um, he was like really excited, you know, um, and yeah, encouraged me to, to, to continue and stuff. In South Africa, in high school, I think in about grade 10, they have to choose a field. Um, and so I wanted to choose to do science, but my maths wasn't good. So my, the maths teacher who was teaching the last two years of high school was also the principal. So clearly she didn't want a failure in her class. So she um, discouraged me into doing maths. So then I had to just stand up for myself and said, nope, this is what I want to do. So I did very well, actually. So I, I, I was in the top five, no, top 10 of my grade throughout from then onwards. When I was in grad school, I chose to do astronomy and I was very own oh, space science. And um, I fell in love with um, space science more, so that's when I decided to change course and do space science instead. The, the reason I'm interested in actually getting the thermospheric winds is that um, winds play a very role in the dynamics of the ionosphere. And so um, if you want to understand how uh, most of the behavior of the ionosphere, you, you know, you need the winds measurement. And if you don't have um, an instrument that measures it, the next best thing is to try and model them. So th that is why I'm interested in, in it. But no. it's interesting what actually sparks the interest. Um, for me, I'd never seen or um, heard of astronomy or, you know, you, that you, you could send a rocket out. I always took for granted that there was just, you look up in the sky uh, at night and there were stars, you know. So it was, it was an interesting um, eye-opener for me, so yeah. So I, I, I will always, now and again, I still watch Armageddon just for nostalgia.